we have with us in the, the studio a, a legend, <laughs> an absolute legend. I'm in uh, awe, like a little boy. <laughs> I feel like I just met Michael Jackson. Wow, oh, oh, David, <laughs> that's too much, man. <laughs> and, 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 and your voice is real. Yeah, it is real. It is. <laughs> <laughs> Treasure Chavalala's voice is real, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> it's not a fake. It's not a fake at all. Where do you get it? Uh, well, from the man upstairs. Yeah, are you honestly saying you've been speaking like this all your life? Well, obviously, when you were much yeah. younger, it was different. That's right. From the time that I broke my voice, I've been speaking like this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So you were speaking like this when you were 18? Yeah, that's it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't make sense. Wow. It would have been a waste if you did not get a chance to work on radio. It would have been a waste. I'm sure you, yeah. you, know, you agree with I me. I agree with you totally. Yeah. Yeah. Imagine if you were somewhere accountant in Gee, it was it would have been a mess, eh? A loss actually. A loss. Yeah, because I remember actually that's how I got this job. I was uh, I was a technician of some kind. Oh, Where? A training uh, technician with okay. one of the uh, technical companies around town. Yeah, and I had gone the Atkinson House, yeah. That's okay, it, yeah. okay. Yeah, in the center of town. This is where there was a little tiny station, Radio SR. Yeah. Ah, there that's we it, go. Yeah. Everybody <laughs> goes back to Swazi Music Radio. Yes, yeah. And the uh, SMR actually had a history. This is where uh, LM Radio used to East, broadcast East. from. Yes, yeah. okay, okay. Yeah. So the and studios so, so, were... Yeah, they took East. over the thing. And it became SMR, which yes, later became, became SR. And you were there minding your business. Yeah, and now how does this uh, uh, sort of link to the technical company yes, that I was, yes, I was yes, working for? Yes. It's because they were, they had little, I mean, they had uh, clients all over the town. Uh, and that particular area uh, happened to house that radio station. Okay, you okay. You, I was in charge of that area now. Yes, yes. To yes. service As a machines, technician. As a technician from this technical company <laughs> to sort of service their machines and do all sorts of things. There. Yeah. So I get to this place <laughs> as normal, go to the Uzo, reception. Uzolungi, yeah, yeah, talk to the receptionist. I'm from this company yes. and I've come to fix this and that and the other. Yeah. Well, the next thing... <laughs> This woman went out of her, her mind. Head. Like, Jesus, what did that voice? I said, no, I'm not talking about the voice. I'm here to, to wear. Yeah. So so no, 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 no. No, I understand that. You're at the right place. We're actually expecting a, a technician. But now your voice is just amazing. What are you doing with this voice? Wow. I said, I said, what do you mean? What am I doing with this voice? <laughs> I'm, I'm living I my use life. This voice to talk. That's <laughs> like everybody else. Yeah, but nothing special after this. She wow. said, no, 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 no. You must just see my boss because I'm sure he'll 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 go wild, eh? Do do you mind doing an audition? What's <laughs> audition an, for what, what? What's an audition it's in it's the first place? I didn't even know what an audition Ooh. was. <laughs> the next thing, she tells me, no, 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 we're going to record you, and try and and, and do a, a mock program. That's and that's it's a demo. You, you know, yes, it's a yes, demo. Kind yes. of so I said, no, I don't mind. We can do that before I start my work. Yeah. <laughs> because to me, this wasn't work. It no, was no. Something. Yeah, well, let's just <laughs> yeah, play yeah. quickly. Yeah, let's play quickly and, yeah, and then I'll do my work yeah. so that I can catch up. <laughs> it's, it's, then wow. he, she organized the whole thing and the program yes. director came through and said, he also said, oh, wow, what a voice. What a voice. <laughs> Everybody's like, yeah, whoa, so what they, a voice. Yeah, he just went mad. Eh? Yes. And they took me on and uh, I went over there. Well, I didn't even know headphones. Headphones, yeah. yes. Uh, All okay. this was new to me. <laughs> Put them on. The next thing. Hi. Gee. Jeez. Yes. I actually got scared. Because we... <laughs> now I, you can hear I it I can back. hear myself. Yeah, yeah. Yes, and yes. I'd never experienced yes, anything like this yes, before. Yes. It was so scary. Quite, ah, quite, yeah. It was weird. Then the next thing, we go through the whole thing. I get yeah. used to it. And then I, I, I enjoy this. This is nice. Myself. This is nice. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> so I went for it, and we did it. We did that mock program and everything. And then they said, "Look, man, we don't even want to waste your time. Look, uh, are you prepared to do certain shows during the weekend?" That are... Shows? I said, "Oh, cool. I can yes. put time aside for this. Yeah, yeah. Just a couple of hours here and there." And we did uh, <laughs> pre-produced programs. Wow! And that's how it started. And that was and, it. Yeah, that was it. <laughs> then I, I had a job with the uh, SR. Minding your business. Minding my business. And did, was, did, um, do you remember uh, having to resign from this company or having to tell your bosses that, hey, 
I think I, I think I got another job with those guys. Actually, yeah, I actually <laughs> handed in my resignation. <laughs> you did, yeah, I said, Look, man, guys, I think uh, I'm done with this now. This is not actually my line. I was just <laughs> trying to conform. Yeah. <laughs> we are cautious, <laughs> man. Man, we are cautious. This is not my line. <laughs> I line. think I've got something exciting to come, which has just come up. Eh? Wow. And they blessed me and said, okay, man, have a good time. Eh? I said, good. So I joined Jeez. these guys. On a part-time basis for that. In fact, I think with that technical company, that was the last time actually. You had a full-time a full-time job. Full-time job. Yes. Yeah. Did, so, did 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 the the DJing job yeah. match your your income at least? It did. It did. Yes. And then you said, "This is great." It, it did. It matched my. my Do you income. remember how much you were earning? Your first. Your first. I remember uh, my first uh, DJ job. Uh, uh, how much it paid me. Uh, it, it still sounds a lot by today's standards. Yeah. But it actually my <laughs> first radio uh, on-air job was free. Uh, yeah. I wasn't paid anything. Oh, oh wow! Radio That's... 2000 didn't pay me. Wow! For a whole year. <laughs> wow! <laughs> <laughs> they didn't. I was paid from day one. From... <laughs> yeah. so it really, no wonder yeah. you've been so lucky. Yeah, I did well. Uh, I was paid from day one. Do you one remember how much it was? I can't. I can't remember now. But top it was of quite mind, a bit. Yeah, it was, was it like a, a thousand, two thousand rands by those standards? Yeah, yeah, yeah. somewhere, somewhere around there. Yes, yeah. yes. And I mean, during those days, no, two thousand rands. Oh no, no two thousand rands. You are yeah. king. You know. Yeah. <laughs> you could marry two wives. She was oh <laughs> two thousand rands. <laughs> yeah, wow, that's... and the ex- excitement here. Yeah. The excitement was just great. Everything was just going according to plan. That's amazing. Oh. T- tell oh. me though. Let oh. let's go back slightly. Yeah. Uh, from where you were born. Yeah. Where are you from? I'm from Soweto, Dube village. Tall boy from Soweto. Yeah. And where born and bred there. Born and bred in Suet. Yeah, with Leva. With Leva. Yeah, like yeah, Pelala yeah, yeah. You don't know any... Inkomo, how's that? Inkomo, I got exposed to them when I went to Swaziland yes. to further my studies. So uh, I, I, I got to Swaziland, did my high schooling there. Mm. And that's when I got exposed to uh, the... the yeah. African kind of lifestyle. Oh, yes, yes, the, the traditional, class, yeah, the, yeah, the, the rural yeah, lifestyle. The rural yes, lifestyle, yes. Yeah. And, and who made the decision to take you to, to Swaziland? My parents. Uh, Why did they see the need for it? They saw a need for it because at that time, I mean, apartheid was, was really, really was right. Yeah, yeah. The kind of education that we were receiving here was wasn't like, good enough. Wasn't yeah. good enough for I them. know yeah. Lefeshen, Le Fashion, Le Tatawantoana to to Swaziland. Yeah. I remember yeah. Le Fashion. Le Fashion. Le Fashion. Yeah, I yeah. get it. How's that Swaziland? That's it. Le Fashion. Yeah, trying to expose us to a better kind of education. That's it. That's it. Yeah, do, that's it. Do you think it benefited you in 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 a lot of ways? That 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 education. I did. Yeah. I, I think. I think. Uh, yeah. I, I think it really, really benefited. Yeah, in the sense yeah. that, you know, it gave me a sense of confidence. Mm. I could express myself without yes. any, ho- yeah, any holding yeah, back holding anything. Back, yeah. Yeah. It, it, it made you free in your mind as well, I imagine. Yeah, yeah. You, you sort of got a chance to think outside the box. Yes, that's true. Yeah. Here at home, everything it was, was just yeah, about, yeah, hey, it doesn't matter how smart you are, you just you, have to think within the box. You are the within box. this little, yeah, this it, yeah. little apartheid you box. Yeah. You can't go beyond and this. And you have to agree with this apartheid box. Hey. Otherwise, your life is going to be hell. Hey. Do you have Do you have any special friends and memories that you made when you were in... Uh, in Swaziland. In Swaziland. People that, that you still know till today. Yeah, there are quite a number of guys that I schooled with in Swaziland yeah. who eventually came back home yeah, yes. and uh, who, are, who, who are South Africans. Yes, yeah, yes, There's yes. quite a lot of them. I some of them from the, Yeah, some of them from the East Rand. Oh, yes, everywhere. Uh, off the yeah. cuff, I can think of guys like Bogodna, Makubu. Okay. Yeah, guys like Bopega Manana. Yeah, same. And we're same, still in contact yes, with them yes. even today, you know. Yeah. yeah. Did, did you have... It's somewhere in the back of your mind, the idea of being a performer. Never. I say this because uh, you seem like you completely stumbled. This this was not going to be your life. Yeah, it wasn't going to be. Ikshaisi no. lel nine nine. Shaisa inje train yama train no shaisa. Cool. Ikshaisi lel yeah. So there was no part of you that had interest in performing and being a presenter. None of it. No, except that at school. In high school, yeah, I was very much interested in entertainment. Okay, we had a school group there oh, singing up front. Okay, it. yes, it to be who are wearing a pace? Who are wearing a pace? Oh, that's it, yes, yeah, that's it. it yeah. Nothing more than that. Nothing more than that. And yes. I thought ah, this thing was just going to end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, it's yes, just a, yes. a, an excitement. But what were you thinking of in in your mind in terms of the type of career you wanted for yourself? Uh, what what mattered to you? And I asked uh, this question. Uh, I asked my mom uh, not very long ago. She's seventy five now. Yeah. I asked her about. 
her aspirations when she was young yeah. if it's something that's still in her mind even yeah. now yeah. because i believe that that part of us never really get grows old yeah. it stays very young forever yeah. and she says she still has aspirations of being a, an accountant uh-huh. she's 75 pelly <laughs> it won't happen yeah. <laughs> she must accept it but <laughs> she says it. she still thinks about it you know right, it's still yeah. something that crosses her mind right. so so wh- what what was what mattered to you at that time in terms of the career you wanted for yourself Look, at that time to be quite honest. Yeah. We were not people who were like actually uh, you know thinking looking, thinking far. about a career or anything. Your, your your only thing was, look, I've reached my trick now. Yeah. And my parents can't afford to take me any further. Uh. I must just think of getting employment hey. and work and Tolum, build yeah. my life. Yeah, we, that's a funny man. As to what I'm going to be, we'll yeah. see about that. It's yeah. really important. Yeah. The yeah. thing is to be able to look after myself. And that's be able it, to yes. Feed myself and also and free your parents from you. From yeah. the responsibility now, exactly, of looking after Exactly, yeah. Because now, yeah. Yeah. that's it, yeah. yeah. And I'll even send if you see that yeah, kind of, yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. And the technical mm. education that yeah. that you ended up with, uh, clearly, how did that come about? In fact, that came about because I thought I must do something and specialize in something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. okay, you know? okay. But uh, I didn't think that uh, that was going to be the be all and the end. Yeah, all or whatever. yeah, yeah. I thought, let me try this. Maybe yeah, I, yeah, can, yeah, yeah, I can be able to be practical. Fix, yeah, with your hands. You know, yeah, you know, yeah. I imagine, yeah, and maybe when I have my own house one day you know i'll be able to fix the door fix whatever or do that's how you saw it yeah that's how i saw it isn't it (laughs) now this came in with something different i thought that's amazing here's something that is quite unique and uh, people from my hood don't even know about Rona Narizomo Radio Fuji that's it yes yes, you know know it well so it (laughs) Radio. We didn't even know what was inside there. Yeah, yeah. There, there are people we were, inside. Yeah. They're so talking. It wasn't something that was really a job. A job. Yeah. That was, uh, hunted or, or, or it aspired, aspired to be. Aspired to by many people. You see, they didn't even know it's about a, it. It's a know? different world. Now. <laughs> Hmm? Completely different. Completely world now. different. Now they all want to do what this this it's job. It, that's it. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody wants to do it. Everyone now. wants to do this job so much so that now, gee. <laughs> it's overcrowded, actually. Well, that's yeah. true. Yes, that's true. There's a lot that that, that are knocking. <laughs> I'm <Amelie Sif>. Yeah. <laughs> like, hey, if that guy dies, then, hey, I'll get a chance. Of <laughs> <being> like, <laughs> <laughs> so bad. Mm. And your upbringing, a mm. mm. What 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 memories do you have of it as a as a uh, young, very tall boy? <laughs> hey man, it was. What quite memories good. cross your mind when you think back to to the days of Umam uh, Nubaba Yeah, they were. There. And my mother's still around, actually. Whoa. Yeah. How she's old like, is she now? She's 91, yeah. My yeah. gosh. <laughs> yeah. That's amazing. She's she lived around, well. Yeah. Yeah, and still strong. Very strong, yeah. She's still going You can on. give her another 10 years. Yeah, I can I still. Wow. I can still give her Because you look years. young yourself. Yeah. <laughs> I must tell you, and I, I, let, me, let me guess your age. Yeah. 62. Now. Should I go down or up? Up. <laughs> 65. 66. Whoa. <laughs> I'm going for 67 at the end of the year. Yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> and you still look young. Are you aware that you still you still have this well, young... Lots of people tell me that. And I, I judge it by, uh, you know, watching other people who are my age group, yes. who I grew up with. And then I look at them. Oh, you so look at them and say, hey. oh, "Come on, this guy, can't, this can't be true." Yeah, yeah. this is my age group, yeah, and look at how they look. Yeah, but you know, but I take it well. People are not of the same. Of the same yeah, fiber, yeah, absolutely, you know? yeah. absolutely. So, and also, yeah. in all fairness, people don't yeah. look at look after themselves the same that's way. It, yeah, that's it. Yeah. That's another thing. That's yeah, because yeah. yeah. because I I had uh, that the Tom Parts were yeah. there, who gives you so much credit. For his career, yeah, yeah, he, he has to pay you royalties. <laughs> he has to, till now. Yeah, but the Tom Pazo must pay you every day. <laughs> say thank you to Randaki Okalawa because uh, he gives you so much credit. Uh, why do you think that is? You seem to to have gone through a time uh, where you just gave people a chance. Yeah, it was in the in the spirit of brotherhood. It was like, hey man, look, there's Here's something going on here. Try so got, yeah, something good might job, come out of yeah. it. Yeah. So I've, I've always been that kind of person. A very yeah, generous it is, kind of it is. Person, yeah. And here's a chance. Yeah. Why do I keep it to myself? It, Let's yeah, share yeah, it. Yeah. yeah. So I've always been very, very generous. Yeah. And, uh, you know, recommending my friends that, hey, look, here's a guy who, here's can, a do guy who can do this. Yeah, yes, yeah. Do you yeah. remember the people you recommended? 
do you mm. top of mind? Because it's not always easy. Because yeah, yeah. you do it and move on with your life. That's it. Yeah. It's them that remember. That's it. Because yeah. they, that's their life story. But for you, it was just yeah. It well, was just a gesture. You know. Is there anyone yeah. though that that you might say? Uh, yeah, I remember uh, Bratom and, uh, and and so and so. Yeah, Bratom. I can think of Shadow Twala. Shadow, yeah, really? Yeah, Tell I'll me say. that story. <laughs> no, I'm curious. He actually recruited her. Like Shadow, there's something going on here. How did you Would know you? Shadow? Shadow was, oh, it was a family friend. Yeah. Ah, okay, yeah. okay. I'm a friend to his brother. Ah, Sandy, that's yeah. it, yes. So we've been friends since Forever, childhood. yeah. yeah. We're together in, 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 at school in yes, Swaziland. Yes. So, yeah. Why, why did you think there was anything mm. special about Sh- Shadow for, for it to be to be on radio? Because of the command of the English language. Language, yeah. Did, because she yeah. also studied in Swaziland. In Swaziland, yeah. yeah. So, I knew that she could handle this with yeah, me. No, this is, yeah, I was to say Connelly. And indeed she did and made a name for herself. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about it. <laughs> yeah. She's still on radio even now. She's still on radio Tell me now. about it. Yo. Shadow Twala. That's it, yeah. That's incredible. Which station yeah. was it then? Was it Swazi? It was uh, Radio Metro. Uh, oh, it was yeah, Metro. Yeah, yeah. She went straight to yeah, the top. Tom, yeah, Tom and what's name? And, 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 Shadow, and Shadow. Yeah. It was Metro. Metro, yeah. That's amazing. When I'm, we, we, <laughs> I, 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 that yeah. positive energy also comes to you. Yeah, what comes around, what, what goes, goes around, around comes, comes around. around. Yeah, yes. that's, that's how I operate. You know, I much I very much believe in in, in that type of thing. Yeah, yeah, sort of giving out good energy. You know, yes, to receive, receive it back. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah. Do Do you yeah. feel that uh, growing older has taught mm. you anything? I'm starting to, my yeah. eyes are starting to open. Yo. I, I didn't know anything. <laughs> I, t- I turned 44 I, yeah. uh, two weeks ago. Right, yeah. I'm only now yeah. waking up like, whoa, yeah. okay, now uh, uh, now that makes sense. Yeah, yeah. And because I believe that we are very young, even in our minds. That's it. Way before 40. Even yeah, yeah. Be, when we get to, that's why probably they say life begins at 40. At 40 yeah. Uh, do you feel growing older has taught you anything? Yeah, it, t- it has taught me a lot, a lot. What, what, what comes to mind almost immediately? Why do you say, yeah, like, you know, I, I see the world differently in this, in this regard? I always, you know, imagine that if I knew then mm. what I know now, yeah, sure. I could have been something else, a force <laughs> to be reckoned with. Yes. See, because life is a thing of teaching you. Yeah. Through yeah. mistakes. That's true. Through faults, through yeah. all the things that you do. And maybe they turn out to be wrong exactly. or, or incorrect. Yeah, yeah. You learn but from you those learn moments. A lot from yeah. those things. You see? Yeah. And then when you are uh, uh, confronted by a problem of that mm. nature, then you're able to deal with it uh, yes. in a better fashion. That unlike when you were younger. When you were younger, <laughs> yeah. With age, you begin to understand. Oh yeah. So all oh, this is how it is. Uh, yes. And then you're able to be, uh, you know, generous. Absolutely. And be, uh, you know, patient. Interesting. All the people that is the word that. I was yeah, waiting that's it, for. Yeah. yeah, that's what I'm learning. Patience and uh, sustenance, yeah. and also the the, the, the tenacity. Yes, you, yes. You learn about all those things. Yeah, that's Which true. cannot be taught to you. You know, you know they're taught or, with time. Yeah, yeah. You can't even buy those things over the counter. No, you, you can't. Eh? You just have to be awarded with those yes. things because of your physical expression. Absolutely. Yeah. So you, you you so you think you're patient now. Yeah, now, now. I've mastered that. Yeah. Do you know young uh, people hate patient parents? Yeah, yeah. Because then, I was finally see a whooping, whooping yeah, on yeah, weekend. Yeah. And then you say, uh, I'll think about it. I'll think about ah, it. Ah, yeah. yeah, yeah. And it is very important for you to, <laughs> to think, think about, about it. it. Yeah. And then the child is like, and then the friends are asking, so has your dad uh, said yes? Uh, ah, he's thinking. <laughs> He's <laughs> thinking, yeah. <laughs> yeah, because he's preparing you to to understand <laughs> what what preparation is, is, all about. is what the meaning of process is, is all about you see? to young people it's like my yeah. dad is thinking again <laughs> <laughs> and they very they get very oh yeah he's they, thinking yeah. i grew up with a friend of mine yeah. a friend of mine's dad yeah. oh, always used to think yeah, yeah. it used to frustrate him yeah. it's fun to see the school yeah. gonna a trip to the zoo yeah. uh, in pretoria mm. five ranti yeah. uh, yeah. and all of that yeah. uh, it's fun as part of like sasa mm. Dead, dead is like, let me think about it. Let me think about it. Xasa comes and goes. Mm-hmm.
And then, and then the day, two days later, he goes again to the father. Oh, that thing. Oh. Nah, nah, you can't go. You can't go. It's like, ah, I've chief. made my decision. <laughs> made, yeah. You should have told me that two that's days it, ago. Yeah. <laughs> so I guess, I guess that's what we learn with time. I we guess. learn that with time. When you've actually got the grasp of it, that's when you, you begin to appreciate even what your dad did at that time. But you appreciate it sometimes when he's not even oh, there anymore. Absolutely. It's and it's it's now it's you it's say, it's in hindsight, yeah. I get it. Mm. I want to talk to you about the concept of luck. Mm -hmm. I I believe I live in a world where mm -hmm. where things like that matter. Mm -hmm. Luck is important. Mm -hmm. right. uh, your right place, right time, mm -hmm. no coincidences, mm -hmm. and all of that stuff. Right, yeah. And I and 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 people seem to talk about you, and it talks about they talk about luck as well. Yeah. They say you're amongst the luckiest people there is. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose it's because I don't know. Uh, I'm a believer. You believe in, in, in a yeah. much higher power than, than and, us. That's right. Yeah. And more than that, I have or I've taught myself to be able to obey. You see what I mean? So I, I, I believe and then I, I, I use obedience. In that. And uh, I find that when I do that, when yeah. I respond to nature in a positive fashion, yeah. then nature rewards, rewards me you. In, in return. You yeah. I mean? So that I believe we're all lucky, actually. G give me an example. Mm. Give me an example mm. of, of mm. your mm. behavior towards mm. nature. And I'm, yeah. I'm using nature yeah. as a reference yeah. To, yeah. to what you just said. Right. Uh, give me an example of mm. of maybe someone will learn something yeah. from this. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe maybe we don't realize that mm. it's as simple as throwing your cigarette butt out the window. Right. You know. Right. Uh, give me an example of, of, of this giving to nature and receiving back from nature. In other words, you you, you got to be the kind of person who listens yeah. to situations. Not only people, but listen to situations as well. Listen to, you know, mm. everything that goes around you. You, you. Somehow you get that thing yes, yes, that yes. connects with you yeah. and tells you that you have been, as a person born, mm. given a certain amount of time over and above through that, that time, time yeah you have been given a certain number of chances and you have in other words if you start from square one using your time which time you are given by nature which yes. means we all have that that's, potential that's, ability yeah you see? yeah and it's yours you, no one can take it away that's from it you. that's now, it what you do with that potential will determine whether you get the results that of, is, it, is in other words you have used that time correctly correctly yeah and you gain something out of and it and you get the and, results that are ideal ideal for, for you, you because yes. you've been obeying nature all that's the way. it yeah whatever goes with that yeah you know? yeah and then Again, you must be able to realize uh, when your time mm. has run out. Maybe you're still alive. You're not even dead, but yes. your time is up. Yes, yes. Maybe you're left with chances on That's you. it, yes. Ooh. <laughs> now, it, is, it means you've got to be more careful now. Yeah, you yeah. You can't be extravagant like you were when you still you know, had time. Yeah, yes, because now, mm. now for sure... Mm. The little time you have is yeah. is a gift now, for sure. And you appreciate it even more now because yeah. you see it's running out. Ooh. And then sooner or later, you'll be uh, 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 depending on finder finders. Right? Yes, yes, is, yes. That's yes. The, 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 yeah. the, 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 the other part now, yes. which has got to do with luck. Yeah. You see? yeah. Have you used the chances, and I'm using your oh. phrasing, mm. have you used the chances that yeah. you've had yeah. wisely, in your opinion? Yeah, I've tried as much as possible to yeah. use all all those uh, uh, you know opportunities, wisely, wisely, yeah, all those yeah. opportunities wisely, so yeah. that I don't run out of time. Yes, yes, yes. because as as because you're time, conscious mm, that yeah. time is limited. Time is limited, and when it runs out, then I only depend on chances. Now, depending on chances only, yes, not uh, very you can't stable. guarantee anything. Yeah, now, yeah. You and that when you still have time. Yeah, well, you, you know, can say things. I try a Even the spirit talks to you yeah. that you still have time. Don't have Go for that. Yes. Or do whatever. You see what I mean? Yeah. But when you don't have time anymore, the voices stop coming to you. <laughs> you, you have to think now. You have to take chances. You have to do whatever yes, to yes. still reach your ultimate goal. You see? So, 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 mm. so, hearing what you're saying, and I like the words you use. Mm. The voices yeah. speaking to you. Yeah. Uh, do you do you feel and hear the voices saying that jiggle up? 
Yeah. Yeah. And everybody feels that. Absolutely. But we kick that out of yeah. our, our, yeah. our system. Our, our, yeah. What what some may call yeah. sixth sense, some may That's call it. instinct, yeah. some may call yeah. Yeah. I felt something, man. Yeah. <laughs> because you beat yourself because you feel I don't deserve this. Ooh. Because I never put any time into it. I never put any effort into Why it. Why are we see, like that? Uh, you see. Why do we feel even some of the greatest mm. chances mm. in the world, mm. we, we're quick to say, nah, it's... You judge yourself because you know that you did not do, do put certain enough things. effort. Yeah. You, you and know you saying? don't always have to put effort to get things. You don't have to. Not always. At times, you just have to obey. Yes, yes. Or be there. And obedience just skips you and you find yourself there. Yeah. Now, but you want uh, uh, an explanation. And then that's when you'll discover that it is because at that point uh. you obeyed. That's amazing. And then that's the results. Of that, yes, yes. You, you and know, it's like, really, was it that simple? Yeah, yeah it was, was that it? simple. Yeah. Like, I remember when I was talking to a, a, a bad boy, T, T, mm. Thomas, uh, mm. um, saying, and I mm. asked him, how did he get his radio job? Mm. And he says, I was just there. <laughs> <laughs> I was just there. Yeah, Not, yeah. Very little effort went yeah. into it. I wasn't even interested. He was working at a restaurant yeah, yeah. and there was an opportunity. There was someone yeah. from Good Hope that happened to be there. Yeah, yeah. And then he said, yeah. hey, you should try that. Oh. Hey, okay, and you should try it. And then eventually he said, hey, I'll go. So, which is similar to yours in a lot of ways. In a lot of ways, it is, yeah. It wasn't, uh, I wanted, I wanted, I wanted, now I have it. Yeah. You, you know, just respond, respond yes. to whatever call. But be prepared to put an effort in it. In other words, putting an effort means if you get something going mm. and then you know you got that potentially because, you know, you deserve it. That's Even it. Even if no. you didn't know. No, absolutely. Said, yeah. And then after that, you have to use now something else. Yeah. In other words, go back to school. Yes. When they used to yes. teach you about potential energy. Yeah. Yeah. How different is potential energy yes. from kinetic energy? Energy. Yes, exactly. Potential energy yeah. is energy that is there. It hasn't been used as energy. Yet. I it's, call it uh, energy plug. Yes, sir. Yeah. Gone. We're all born until you yeah. plug it and switch it on. Now, now you jump onto another bit of energy, exactly. which is kinetic, now, yes. to move this potential into energy. motion. Yeah, and then you've got kinetic energy. So if you you, yeah. you can just you know lay your life along those lines, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. We, we all walk around with potential yeah. energy. Yeah, <laughs> that's why you find young stars has got a, a potential for playing soccer, but you find that he never ends anywhere because he did not convert that potential energy into anything into kinetic. Yeah, and we see them. You see, you see, yeah. you spot talent instantly. That's it. You see, you, your luck. Uh, t they speak of winning things. Get a, yeah, yes, yeah, yeah. we talk about that. much luck on. We are win. Couldn't I win? I. Yeah, you know, it, it, it becomes something else. Yeah. Wow, man. Yeah, no, I've, I've won quite a lot. You know, in your life, in my yes. life. Yeah. See, that's well, the. Think, no, what's wrong? Well, you Is won. It me? What? No. You, you won know? something else. Yeah. You see. What is, what is the most memorable win you've had? Like with the eye, uh, uh, I can't believe it. <laughs> you win it. Yeah, I once walked into a casino. Actually. Yeah. Uh, I had about 50 rand in my pocket. Yes, the yes, last 50 rand. Yes. I didn't know what was going to happen. And I started playing 50 cents. Was it the machine? Yeah. Yeah, because the machines cents. are easy. Yeah. Everybody can play it. Yeah. You know, oh, that's, one that's a yeah. long time ago. Yeah. If you were uh, pulling, because yeah. mine is their press. Yeah. <laughs> the one I'm bending. And before I know it, I thought the machine was broken, actually. <laughs> The next thing, everybody was all around, around me. Around you? And, what did you win? Almost 2.4 million. What uh, the hell? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's a casino with your last 50 yeah, bucks. You know, yeah. And I went on to play another machine and I got another sum again, almost 200,000. Yeah. <laughs> Same night. Eh? So, Same you know, night. Oh, uh, you say, uh, I'm still here. I'm still here. Let me waiting play. for them to... Eh. Hey, we get organized. That's when I realized, no, man. One has got to take these things seriously. Wow. Yeah. I guess I said, what, what blows me away. There must be something good I'm doing. So I had to search what it was, eh? You did search. What did yeah. you find in your search for this luck? And you, I guess you just realized that. I realized that because I obey nature, this is what happened. What you get? Yeah. yeah. Wow. You see? I, I must tell you, it two point mang mm. mang, uh, guy born. Uh, yeah. It's the fact that you went and played again and still won 200,000 yeah, so on the same night. I thought, this must be, you know, 
and I knew there was nothing extraordinary I had done. Nothing. To, to create that kind nothing. of Nothing. You just came. <laughs> but it just happened. You know? <laughs> and I mean, even today, I still continue to win. Whenever. Sometimes I'll say, ah, God, let me just go to the casino. There, 5,000. You know? If I look, and let's, let's I find someone sitting next to me saying, hey, "Yeah, I've been what's here. Happening? I've been here. I've been here the whole day. And <laughs> what, <laughs> what actually is happening here?" Jeez, <laughs> and I said, "No, nothing. That's amazing. Just believe and obey. That's, that's it. amazing. <laughs> that is incredible. Yeah. I must yeah. tell you though, because because I remember like, this is because uh, uh, Tom Patsu mentioned your yeah, luck. He yeah. said, "Ah, real uh, <laughs> weed." <laughs> <laughs> and they couldn't believe how, but. God has always done these things for me. Yeah. yeah. In one way or another. It means the way I pray to him, the way I talk to him, the seems, way I obey seems him. Seems to wear. Something right that I'm doing. Do it, I don't it, know what it is. Yeah. But, so I always try and be You should you should you should teach. You yeah. should teach, you should share, you should open a, yeah. like a church. Yeah. <laughs> Who knows? Really? Uh, because I believe in the in the power of luck as yeah. well. Yeah. And but not complicated luck. I believe yeah. you ask for it, you get it. Yeah, and sometimes it. we're not asking in, in so many words. We don't say, ke kupa, ke yeah, yeah. It's, it's, the, it's your thoughts also speak yeah, to these yeah. things that you want. Right. Uh, you find yourself in a little bit of a, of a situation yeah, yeah. and then you focus your energy towards yeah. solving it yeah. and then it solves itself. It solves itself. Yes, oh. yes. Which means, Ukupile, but you didn't, you, didn't, you didn't use the words that, that, that are kupa. traditional yeah. in that regard. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And Rape, how Kupa? Yes. You must have done certain things before Ukupa. That's it, yes. Even the Lord's Prayer teaches us. It says, first of all, submit yourself before God. In the uh -huh. Pick him up, our Father who art in heaven. Yes. Hallowed be thy name. Yes, yes. Thy yes. kingdom come. Yeah. Those are things that you have to do. You have to help in bringing down the kingdom on yes, earth yes. so that it happens here on earth. Absolutely. In the same fashion of heaven. That it happens and then in, in heaven. Then, yeah. It's then, it's then when, it's, when it says now, yeah. give us this day our, our daily, daily bread. bread. So in other words, you can't just come and and Ukope, say, okay, and we haven't done the preliminaries. So like, 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 I like, 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 Pretorians like uh, this. Uh, but you can't just walk into a conversation yeah. without greeting. Yeah. <laughs> you see, you have to do first things yes. first and until then, you get to the part yes. where now they say, Give us this Kofa. day. Yeah, give yes. us this day. Yeah. And then you find that everything that comes after give us this day, these are things you receive now. They just keep coming. Because you started by doing what you ought to have done yeah. before asking. You do, do you think uh, human humans have... God's power and God's strength. Uh, by this, I mean we are the extension of 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 His His power. We are. Uh, we are an extension of God's being, let yes. alone His power. Yeah. You understand what I mean? Yeah. So we can command things to happen. Yeah. But only if we move along His His, his know, line. His yeah. line. Yeah. You understand what I mean? Yeah. For me, your your radio career is an interesting one, and what I like yeah. about it is you're yeah. still on radio even now. Yeah, I still am on radio. Yeah. <laughs> I want to be on radio when I'm 66. <laughs> oh, I, that uh, give me a radio show when I'm 66. All right. <laughs> Have you stopped being on radio at, at any point uh, for, for a considerable amount of time? No, no. I've always gone on from one place to another. One Tell me another. about the trip yeah, from yeah. Uh, the receptionist thinking yeah. that your voice is amazing. Right, yeah. What, what happened next from a radio right. point of view? That was in 1978. And then a year... Jeez, after, I was a kid. Okay, yeah. keep, I was three years old. <laughs> keep going. <laughs> yeah. After that, I was headhunted. I got a gig with a station called Capital Radio. Ooh. It was a brand new station. Yes. So to me, that came with, a, with an opportunity now mm. of cracking something that I haven't been involved in. Before. That of opening up a new radio station. Absolutely. Oh, so so it was something. it was brand new when was, when when they called you up. Yeah. Yeah. You see, you know, they're still forming it. Yes. yes. It hadn't even gone wow. on. Air. It haven't even gone on air. Wow. So they yeah. heard your voice from uh, from Swazi. From Swazi. Yeah. You see what I mean? So they were picking up hand picking voices people who everywhere. Who wouldn't work. Some of them yeah. were coming from Britain. You know. That's America amazing. And everything. So I was one of the people that went down there for an audition. I yeah. Was flown down to the then Transkei. Transkei at the yeah. time. Yeah. I stayed for about. It was a weekend. And and they uh, said, yeah, this guy is all right. Jesus, the same voice thing. You know, it just <laughs> hit, hit, hit them. And uh, we, we got in. They said, we got you. Got me Come in. over. Yeah, yeah. They arranged to have me. 
relocated down to all Tanzania. the way yeah. Hey? yeah i was relocated there i stayed there for about three and a half years eh? yeah and i also got the op- got the opportunity of seeing this thing being started from from scratch. the ground up you yeah. saw those yeah. teething uh, yeah. challenges of yeah. forming, forming a radio station yeah no one was an expert there. no 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 yeah We're just all potentially good do you remember any other voice at the time that that yeah. remained popular over the years kevin savage oh kevin savage kevin was also savage. part of that team part of the team wow yo Jeez. who else <laughs> john burks john Bur- oh hell okay you know? all right you going back you going yo. back that was the yeah. first team yeah, yeah yeah capital radio yeah capital radio yeah. Yeah. what show yeah. were you doing at the time i was doing the 7 to 10 show called Tre- the evening. treasures pleasure hey. yeah that's right. yeah in the <laughs> you're, evening you're yeah. interesting you're saying treasures pleasure yeah yeah jeremy mansfield when okay. he was here yeah yeah you said i ah, that that man <laughs> will say it's a pleasure I'm with Jeremy Mansfield now. I know. On heart, yeah. I know. <laughs> That's why he said that man will say I'm with. Uh, it's a pleasure to it's be pleasure. with treasure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you did. You did. You did a nine. You said seven to seven nine. to ten. Seven yeah. to ten. Yeah, Early yeah. evening radio. Early evening. Music. Radio. Music radio. Music. Yeah, telephone calls. Yes, yes, that things. kind yeah, of yeah, stuff. Yeah. It, yeah, and you said a three-year period. Then you moved to another station. No, I moved to Joburg now. Oh, okay. Yeah, because things went, went shaping up well. Oh, you know, okay. Yes. Both on the political front. Ah, of course, of course. The, we were with dealing with a, of, a Bantu stand, and right, yeah. you know, yeah, the challenges with a with a yeah. apartheid government. So I shifted back to Joburg, but still working for for for, for the guys. For yeah, yeah. 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 Because I remember then, at some point, uh, Capital uh, was broadcasting from, from Durban. Durban. Yes, yeah. yes. They had to use, move from Transkai and go, uh, move up to Durban. On the beach so said, no, and on going, your dial. I'm not going yes. to Durban. Yes, I remember their, their payoff line. Yeah. yeah, they used to say, on the beach and <laughs> yeah. on your dial. That's it. Because yeah. I was in Durban at that time as a student. That's <laughs> yeah. why I remember it. Right. Yes. Oscar Renzi was there. Oh, as well. Yeah. Jeez, mm. what a time. Yeah. And then you moved to Joburg. And then I moved to Joburg. And then whilst in Joburg, then I sort of... Took mm. a little sabbatical, just yeah, a yeah, couple of years. It, yes. it wasn't even two years or so. Yeah, eighty six was on, was on my doorstep. Nineteen eighty six. Yeah, the big nineteen eighty six, first of September. Yeah, yes. Gus now recruited yeah. me. Do you remember that that mm. the the early conversations with Gus? Did you know him beforehand? Yeah, I knew him beforehand yeah. as a sports caster. Sports guy, yes. Yeah, he was yeah. a sports presenter. Was a sports yeah. Pre- so he was just the radio yeah. guy. Yeah. It, yeah. What did he say to you? Uh, what was what was what what station was he talking about to you? Because mm. your conversation with mm. him mm. was literally one of the early conversations yeah, yeah. of of Metro FM. That's right. Yeah. yeah. What conversation was he saying? He told me, "Look, uh, Treasure, <clears throat> I've been offered an opportunity here mm. to launch a brand new mm. black commercial radio station." Yeah. We didn't even have a name or anything like yes. that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Look, we don't have a budget for this. Yeah. But I'm prepared to pay a stipend. A stipend yeah, a stipend, a stipend yeah. yeah. Just to keep you guys yeah. going, yeah. But now, we have studios and everything. We'll use the SABC studios yeah. and give us yeah. studios and everything. Yeah. No budget, so... Are you interested? I said, look, let's go for it. Let's try it. And at that time now, I had the experience of starting a radio, a radio station. station. <laughs> yes, you've been there. Yeah, I've been there. Yes, so, so, yes. Wow. It came in handy. It came in handy. So th- th- that's the kind of talk that uh, was Wow. Then it get me other guys that you know that are relevant for me. So he, he, he you now, gave you that, because he uh, told me that uh, he was alone. Yeah. yeah. Literally alone. Literally alone when he came to me. Yeah. <laughs> So we started now getting the right kind of people, which is where now Bo Tom came yes, in. Yes, yes, Shato. But the first guy that came in was the late Mishma Peter. The very first, you yeah. See, he's the guy that I contacted. It said, and together we contacted Lucky Tule. Because now Mish mm, and Lucky yeah. were not new faces to me. No, yeah, because you had worked with them at Swazi. At Swazi. Uh-huh. You see the, you Absolutely. See. So they were Absolutely. part of my yes. team from yes. there. So you so knew, you're I, getting, I they're cooked, these uh, ones. Yeah. They are ripe. You understand? <laughs> yes. Yeah. And wow. then the rest of the people that are pulled in now were people yeah. that had lived with me. Some yes, were not yes. even in radio. Yes. They had been doing something else before, but they were known to me in, yeah, sort of m- yeah, in my close yeah. circle. Do you remember, and yeah. and, 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 and I, I don't feel bad if you mm. don't, uh. how Tom ended up on, on, on radio? Do you remember the, the, the uh. events leading up to that? To that? Yeah. Yeah, no, I spoke to Tom. Yeah, and, and said, I said, Tom, look, there's this come thing. over. Yeah. I'm going to, 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 to this new thing that I'm yeah. doing now. <laughs> so Tom, 
<laughs> offered to come with me. I said, okay, cool. And I took him by the hand. Yes, and, yes. And I, I took him to work with me. Hey, let's, said, let's go. Yeah, look. <laughs> I was go. going to work and he was coming to watch. And, and, <laughs> and he watched me and I was working over there. And then <laughs> he also approached Ko Ko and say, come and, on, and I want to do this. I need something to do. And they understood each other and yes. just gave him the job. And he started doing. And I literally showed him. Yeah, how, how, how to, to run the yeah, desk, how to, how to yeah. speak. <laughs> <laughs> wow, man! Yeah. That's and we're very close with Tom. So no, no, no! I know, perfectly. I know. It, it, because he's been on that very chair. Yeah, he was yeah. one of the very first people like I called. Yeah. And uh, it, it, uh, for me, the stories are always very sweet, <laughs> eh? And 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 you you saw a uh, metro grow slowly and quietly. Slowly, from strength to, to strength. strength. Yeah. It went on. And I stayed with them for about what? Eleven years? She no, yeah. <laughs> that's for quite the longest time. That's <laughs> quite what was your first show at Metro? I know Lucky Julie really was doing breakfast. Uh, I did the evening because I was an evening man. My voice yes, was yes, like, yes. No, it was too heavy. No, for, I'll help you yeah. with this. This yeah. is this is now uh, a uh a course uh, uh, exclusive. Yeah, yeah. Uh early first few weeks, yeah. there were a few of you. Yeah. You did afternoon drive before yeah. Lawrence came along. Okay, yeah, yes. yeah. And then when Lawrence came along, because Ro- Lawrence wasn't in the first team. Oh right. Okay. He, uh, he was in the team that came one, once the station was there, but the, the, the shows were in the wrong places. That's right. Yeah. And then the voices were in the wrong places. Yeah. yeah. So that's when um, uh, Lawrence came along. Yeah. And uh, you then said, "I'll move to to afternoon." To, to, yes, to yes. Early evening. Yeah. Early evening. Yeah, yes. Early evening. Early evening. Yeah, yeah. And then with early evening came. Yeah. Did you, you? I know you once did night time, as in twelve to nine right, yeah, in the yeah. evening. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I did a similar thing, and uh, except that it wasn't Treasure's Pleasure. On yes, yes, it was, yes. It was. Uh, I got sponsored by uh, Shell. Oh yeah, yeah. Shell goes trucking. Oh, yeah. everybody remembers. <laughs> everybody remembers Shell <laughs> goes trucking. Yeah. <laughs> Shell goes trucking. That one big, eh? Yeah. That was a big deal. That's it, yeah. Interesting, uh, even a, 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 a thing uh, that the ghost mentioned, the shell yeah, goes tracking. Yeah. That was a popular show. Very, very popular. And I was dealing here with uh, truck drivers. drivers and uh, <laughs> Jesus, it just became a monster show. Chia. And uh, it became an indicator even for people I got to learn afterwards. Mm. People who were carrying illicit things oh, moving yes. across the country. Oh, yes. You know, th- th- that thing gave them you know, yeah, because now they were on the they spotlight. Were, they were able to communicate through my show. You know, <laughs> wait a minute, yeah. wait a minute. Yeah. Uh, because someone would call, yeah, and and say ngu pigu pigu, yeah, ngu pigu 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 pigu, and then tell the other one in a coded language that that the, there are cops there, there are traffic cops there, and there's a whole <laughs> block there, and, <laughs> and they were talking. Yo, sorry, sorry. <laughs> talking to themselves through, through the show. The show. <laughs> yeah, <that's> wow, <laughs> I wouldn't have thought of that. <laughs> Very, very, very. I uh, wouldn't have thought that would be even possible, and now clearly uh, can. <laughs> Shell I got goes, to know about it too afterwards. That, that was being done on my show. <laughs> Shell goes trucking. That's amazing. That's it. Eleven, eleven years at Metro. Any yeah. of the names uh, that 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 were special to you on radio? I say uh, this because uh, I'm 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 a complete fan of radio, and th- there's yeah. a lot of people on radio, even on the yeah. station that I work for, that I just I listen to and with awe, and I'm a, I right. always enjoy them mm. when they're on the radio. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Are there names that that come to mind that you remember in that in that era? In that era, there's quite a lot, man. Guys that I still meet even now when I yeah. go to when I go to the radio awards and yes, stuff. Yes, eh? of course, yeah. You meet there, some yes. I haven't seen for donkey years. Yeah. Like Alex J, eh? Yes, eh? <laughs> we had a good rapport with yeah. He was from a sister yeah, station. station at, uh, at five, uh, which five, is yeah. next door. And a lot of uh, Bunny Simon. Yes, uh, yes. You know, Tony Sanderson. Yeah. Jeez. Jeez. There's plenty of these guys, eh? Kevin Savage. These are yeah. these are big names in radio. Yeah, but, <laughs> these know, are names that yeah. have defined South African radio in a lot of ways. Yeah, yeah. Jeremy Mansfield. Yeah. Yes, quite a number of them, man. Yeah, because uh, uh, did you work with Jeremy at Capital? Probably not. No, no, no. Uh, he I was, came after. I was gone already. Yeah, he, he came yeah, after. He yeah, because yeah. yeah. you were right at the beginning. Yeah, yeah. he came the, after. The guy I worked with there just before I left. Yeah, was. Uh, David O'Sullivan. Okay, David all right. Yes. Yeah. Well, he's doing breakfast. Yeah, now, as Kaya. I was mo- yeah, as I was moving out of, uh, <laughs> he was, he was getting, his, yeah, his, his, literally. Yeah. Yes. Gee, was there's quite a lot of these guys. It's man. a lot of names. Yeah, eh? guys I haven't uh, mentioned will have to forgive me, really. And so the guy, the guys yeah. at Metro. 
Mm. Uh, you worked with the likes of uh, Bo, uh, um, uh, Granti, obviously. Grant Shagwani, yes, yeah. Yes. Was, I, I still do gigs with Grant. Even though I <laughs> Listen say, to yeah. that. Yeah, when they call us for gigs, they yes. say, hey, you and Grant, they Come just together. give us the old spice, eh? <laughs> and I, I, I do and you guys enjoy it. We yes. enjoy it. Because yeah. I know Grant sent me a text mm. yeah. about a week or so ago yeah. Yeah. saying, hey, Mashabel, yeah. since I did that uh, radio yeah. thing of yeah. yours with yeah. cameras, yeah. I'm getting a lot of jobs. <laughs> Oh. And he says, hey, I'm busy, I'm working. <laughs> <laughs> it's really working wonders. Right? Yes. Oh, really. <laughs> and, and something that I've noticed also with the guys that I've invited here, mm. there's something youthful about, about them that I don't know whether it's radio that keeps uh-huh. you young or it's just an outlook on life that keeps mm. you young. Yeah. There's still a very youthful energy about all of you. Yeah, we, we actually, I don't know, it's because... Maybe we're meant to work until we die, right? Eh? Maybe you are. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you are. Because there's still these, you're still uh, young guys. That's it, yeah. Completely at heart. There's just no room for retirement. Eh? No, no, so no, That's no, the no. thing. Not yeah. at all. You know. And yet, doing a band, but you can do Uhambani. Uhambani, you know? <laughs> yes. Yeah. And you're thinking, I'm, I'm not even planning on it. I'm not even planning on it. And uh, someone asks me, hey, you can do Uhambani, you know? Yes. Is when I, well, I understand because of this uh, employment situation. Absolutely. That, everybody you know, wants everybody an opportunity. Wants, yeah. yeah. And, uh, you know, I suppose if we'd already made it, then we You know, if, if making we'll it say, means... Okay, look, yeah. let me shift and give some yeah, else a yeah. chance. Yeah, yeah. You're still living. You're still I'm alive. I'm still living. I still need something <laughs> to... To, to, want to, to live. Yeah, and you still it, need yeah. something that gives you purpose. That's you it, know? Yeah. Mm. After Metro, where did you go? And why did you leave Metro? I left uh, Metro and uh, people asked me... Uh, uh, who leaves Metro? Oh. Say, well, you get tired, I guess. You're only human. <laughs> yeah. So why did you leave Metro? Uh, it gets to a point. Yeah. In fact, when I left Metro, it was... Uh, my contract was not renewed, actually. Mm. Metro. I did not leave Metro. Yeah, but my contract was not renewed. Yeah. Suppose it was change of management. Yes, yeah, yes. Of was, was, out was, of was, it, was it the oh. big change? Yeah, of course, was not there anymore. Right? Oh yes, yeah. yes, yes. And uh, whoever was there afterwards, yeah, they just yeah, they needed a different yeah, type of radio. They, yeah, yeah, yeah. They had their own plans. You yes, see? that's true. And they were managing the station, so they decided no. You know, it's time for new voices. It's time for new voices, and what have you? And of course, descri- a, describes the time at Metro mm, mm. as a. Um, an interesting time where he consulted a lot with you guys as 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 um, as presenters, which is not common to find a presenter, a, a, a station manager that yeah. consults extensively with 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 you guys That's with right, with yeah. presenters. Yeah. Do you remember all of those those consultations that Kuz used to do? Exactly. Yeah, yeah. we used to we used to have lots of meetings. Yeah. And uh, Kuz was like, you know, open, yeah. transparent. And yeah. He would come up with everything and. Just laid on the table and, and says this, discuss it and yeah. tell him, "Hey man, Numza, nothing here. How no, about how, how about, about this and that? No, don't take that. No, don't allow that to yes. happen." Do open. you think that made a difference in 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 the in the growth and the the very quick, well, maybe not so quick mm-hmm. growth? Yeah, yeah, Metro, the yeah. the openness and yeah. the consultations it, yeah. and all of that. Yeah, yeah, it had a very very heavy impact. Yeah. It worked. Positively, actually. Did you contribute to lineup changes and things like that? As a team, yeah, yeah. we did, we did. To say, yeah, let's yeah. hire this guy, That's let's right. not hire this one. Yeah, yeah. That's amazing. We did, but... You could, you could never find but that. But he still had the, 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 the final, final say. say. of the course, say. yeah, yeah. Because yeah. 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 he was saying, like, I'm thinking yeah. of such and such a yeah. person, and what yeah. do you think? Yeah. Jeez. And, uh, you know, we were so open, and we, we really never y- took the, the vindictive... Yeah, no, 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 yeah. nothing like that. Yeah, eh? it, yeah. And uh, and and in terms of uh, uh, revenue as well, oh. the station at the beginning obviously it wasn't yeah. making so much That's money. Right, Nobody yeah. knew it. Yeah. Do you remember the growth of listeners and the growth of revenue of Metro? Do you remember that energy when the station was growing? Yeah, I remember it very, very well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it was a, it was the best of times, eh? Yeah, yeah. But then with time, which made me not mind actually when I was. Uh, when my contract was not, was not renewed, yeah, I had gone into so many, so, so many, many things, other yeah. avenues. Yeah, you see what I mean. Yeah, and so and the, it was yeah. taking a bit of my time. Ah, okay. And I was, yes. Yeah, I had movies were in the scene. I know. Now, I yes, <laughs> that's why. Because that's another. That, that's why you remember. If you go back to our conversation, <laughs> I asked, yeah. 
Yeah. Where did the performance come from? Yeah. Because we've seen you on TV. Yeah, yeah. We've seen you doing stuff. Now That's we've right. seen you in movies. That's right. Yeah. It's like, hey, my daughter. Mm. This, this is now in there from a technician. Yeah, because, <laughs> you know, it just became like second nature, you know. I tried something and it just worked. Do you remember the first TV production or movie production that you did? My first movie was Stoney, the one and only. Jeez. The boxing movie. Yes. Yo. And you were Boy Steri. Yeah, being hysteria now. <laughs> and they, you know, this movie, they, they, it was actually well prepared for. I actually had to go to the gym. And, and train. And train like I was preparing for a fight. Mm. And yet it was all like preparing for this movie road. That's amazing. Yeah. But but we, we, we were serious. Yeah, it was. But we move with Bella. Not, uh, not uh, <laughs> cheap, cheap, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, uh, and uh, I was graced by some of the best, you know, actors, actors around yes. you know, of the time. Jeez. Bom Shefan and Dabam Yes, Fawo, they were there. Mapuno yes. Sabela. Yes. Sidney Chama. They're all wow. like, hey, <laughs> you know. And, it, but they, and hey, this was your first acting. This was my first movie. You had never done. I was surrounded by these stars. <laughs> Proper <around> actors. <laughs> do, 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 do you remember ever thinking that maybe this is not for me? Hey, man. Oh, the movies. The acting, yeah. No. You it, thought. I just embraced it. And I thought, <laughs> gee, this feels good. <laughs> and the director said, oh, you look Perfect. Perfect. Uh, you know, tall stature, yeah. big voice. You, you know, this is good. Uh, you can even shiny go in black the, man. You know, we can't even. We can even go with you without any makeup, man. You're, yeah. just, you're just perfect. For those. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Jeez. And you've done more after that. I did lots and lots after that. But, uh, <laughs> gee, it was. Jeez. And any, the, any anyone that 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 comes to mind. There must be a one that you think. Yeah, yeah, I've been there. Oh, oh. Is there is there anyone that that you can think of immediately? Uh, I did a movie called what was this movie, man? Oh, I American. Did it, I did it in Italy. No, yeah, I was flown to Italy to yeah. do it. What role the were you? The vulture is a okay. patient, baby. Vulture what role were you playing? I was playing a you know, minor role, really. But yeah, I was just excited by the fact that I was acting with uh, big know, gay, big names. Big names. In Europe and stuff. Yes, yeah, yeah. Eh? Oh, yeah. But it was quite good. You were the man yeah. there. Because <laughs> yeah. you know, you know, I'm thinking about it, Guti. Oh. There's still, clearly there's still an actor in you. Yeah, I can still perform. Yeah. I, I am a natural performer. Yes, yeah, yeah. clearly okay. there's still an actor yeah. in you. <laughs> so there's a script waiting. Uh, yeah, there must be a script waiting somewhere. Somewhere, yeah. yeah. Which will just, you know, embrace... And just go into it, well, yeah. Because, because yeah. I can only imagine yeah. you, you can do Mufasa very easily. Oh, you Mufasa. can do the voice of Mufasa, of Mufasa yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. quite easily, yeah. actually. <laughs> Son, yeah. <laughs> With, when yours, it's a natural voice right. as well. Yeah. Yeah. Do you still do a lot of of, of voiceovers? Yeah, I still do quite a lot, as in commercials, mm. as in. Uh, corporate AVs. Yes, and, yeah. yes, yes. There's yeah. still a lot of those yeah. as well. That's amazing. That mm. I must tell you, it's it's the world's greatest gift to have the voice that you have. Yeah, because you can do anything with the voice. You can. Yeah. You're like, you're, uh, you're like uh, 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 you know, you can go into so many places. Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. After Metro, where did, where did you, which job, which station did you work for? After Metro, I went on to Josie FM. Really? Yeah. Cheese of all. Josie FM. Because that was almost at mm. the beginning as well. Yeah, I, yes. thought, I thought, let me do something for my local guys here. Yeah, and let me enjoy I radio. From Dube, so yes, it's, it's a sekasi. I just walked to work and, uh, and I used to and, walk yes. to work and come back. <laughs> and yeah. come back to your show. Yeah. yeah, and I did a lovely jazz show for them. Oh. They can't even forget it even today. Yes, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm. For, quite a, for quite some time. For quite some time. Yeah. I was with them for about five years. Eh? Wow, yeah, yeah. that was that's yeah. a considerable yeah. amount of yeah, time. Yeah, that's yeah. It, yeah. <laughs> Now you are you are on uh, Hot ninety one nine. But I went to seven oh two before Hot. Before that, yeah, you, before did, Hot you did you did you did the weekend yeah, the, the weekend solid yeah solid gold Sundays, solid gold Sundays Saturday yeah. And Sunday, yeah. Jeez, man, your voice. And now I'm with uh, Hot ninety one nine. And, and you're, you're 9 to 12? 9 to 12, In, yeah. the, evenings. in the evenings? Mondays to Fridays? Mondays to Fridays. Except that I'm not there physically because I'm, I pre-produce it. Oh, you yeah. pre-produce it, voice, yeah. Voice yeah, clips yeah. And, yeah. and you send it yeah. through. Yeah. Because of this being wanted here and there. And there it, and makes it, yeah. Yeah. It, it makes it difficult. It makes it difficult, to, yeah. So, yeah. But I, I still love radio. I, what, what, do you, what do you call the show now? I bet you still well. has pleasure in it. <laughs> I would put in pleasure. I would say treasure in pleasure in it. Well, I call it... 
Yeah, love songs with treasures, something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. evening love songs. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. And it's and it's it's soul and R and B. Yeah, it's it's, it's uh, old school and R and B. Yes, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. yeah. that mm. station, jeez, mm. that station is surprising everyone. It's surprising everyone, and look, they keep scooping station of the oh. year. It's I think this and is the fourth year and running. It's a community uh, radio it's station. A community radio station. <laughs> but I think the, I think he invested a lot in uh, legends. The talents yeah, because are the, the, amazing. Yeah, you see, you, you didn't uh, concentrate on, 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 on going for youngsters. No, yeah, so yeah. You just said, okay, guys, anyone who needs a home to relax in, you know, and uh, and, and and finish off their career. Yeah, you know, this is the station. Yeah, is You'll the be station. here for ten years. Yeah, yeah, It'll work. Yeah. As long as we know we're community. That's it. We're yeah. all about the people. That's it. Wow. So it works out wonderfully. And your passion for radio, as you, as you put it, you still love radio. Yeah. What is it about it that matters so much about about radio? To about you? radio. Yeah. I think the it, 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 the fact that it's such a private yes. something. It's yes. so private and yet so encompassing. Yeah. Yeah. It? Yeah. But you can manage to do anything. That's true. On radio. Yes. Yes. You can make funny faces. Nobody sees you. <laughs> Nobody yeah. cares. Yeah, you know. yes. It's how you come out, how you sound. Yeah, but yes. if you, when you do those funny yes. faces, then some character comes out of you. Yeah. That's beautiful. That's it, yeah. 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 And it doesn't have to go out there. Yes. Like, mm. What type of radio do you think over the years you've done? What type of radio do you enjoy doing in terms of the overall energy and the feel of, of, of the show? Yeah, I'd, I'd I'd love to do I love doing shows where I'm actually where I have much to say about the making of the music, you know. Ah, okay. Yeah, okay. You know, okay. Talk a bit about the production side, talk yes. a bit about what is this? Yeah. The product yeah. itself. Yeah, I mean. okay. Yeah, so okay. that when I do music, yeah. rather than speak about the artist who's yeah. in Who's, a, who's an individual, a private individual like True. me? True. You know? Yeah. I'd rather talk about what that artist does. Yeah. You know? See. See. And all what the people went that are involved that. in yes, making in all of that. And, yeah. And, and yeah. Bringing this out. You see? Okay. <laughs> no wonder then so, <laughs> Solid Gold worked so well. Yeah, it was good. For because me, yeah. it's it's that's where you get to shine and, yeah. and make the music shine that's as well. It, yeah. 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 Mm. Jeez, who else do you think I should invite on on that chair? On this chair. Yeah. I've had Lakin Tuli, by right. the way. Right. You've had Lakin Tuli. I've had uh, Bra Tom. Right. I've had Bra Grant. Right. Uh, I've had uh, Jeremy. Yes. So let's hear which names you'll mention. Okay. You haven't had Shadow? Mm-mm. Shadow. Shadow is in Cape Town, but we'll uh, still try. Right. Yes. Yeah. There's no Temba, too. I mean, I know no Temba. Ah, uh, she was the last one on that chair. Oh, she was here. Yes. But she's been here already. Hey, I'm, I'm, yeah, 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 she's. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <mom, yeah>, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Bob. Mm. And who else is there? There's quite a number of guys, actually. Any mm. station that that you've enjoyed working for, you always look back and say, "That was fun. Mm. Those were good days." Mm. Is there any station that 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 comes to mind? Funny enough, I've actually enjoyed all the stations that I've worked. For. Yeah, mm. yeah. You had yeah. it had they had their own different character, yeah, but you've enjoyed. Everyone's been it. so nice at all these stations. <laughs> They've been so nice to me. Yeah, yes. so I really. You're clearly not a difficult guy to work with. Yeah, yes. and, and I don't interfere, you see. That's yeah, <laughs> you, you let you let I them. To write it yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. You let them do what they yeah, want. Yeah, and that's it. You'll call me when you need me. Yeah, that's yes, it. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and I suppose it's because I'm always busy. I'm always doing something. I always yeah. have a project going on. And There's always, yeah, yeah you don't, you yeah. can't get too involved. Otherwise, yeah. you won't have yeah, the time. That's yeah, that's it, yeah. Hey, do, uh, you've, been, you've, you've been married a while, I imagine. Yeah, yeah. Yes. yeah what, do, what do you have to tell young stars like us about marriage? Uh, I have not married yet. I, I'm no. starting to think maybe I should. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You, you, but take your time. What is taking my time? Actually, uh, maybe you can help me. What is taking uh, my time? Another 10 years? I'm 44 now. 44, yeah. Oh. Yeah, maybe you Yeah, you can just about get hitched now. <laughs> you so, see, that's my you point. You can live for 50 years with your wife. There right? you go. So it's not bad. <laughs> it's not bad, yeah. <laughs> so, so, so what do you have to say to some of us about, about the idea of getting married? I had a debate uh, with friends of mine that uh, says uh, it's an overrated concept. Uh-huh. What do you have to say to that? I believe marriage is the rock on which you can actually build a family. Mm. Wow. Mm. Wow. Yeah, because if you treat it right and yes. go into it for the right reasons, yeah, then you'll never fail to discover that there is no family without God. What is the right reason? Uh, to have a family. Yeah. 
which family will then be the rock yeah. that you're going to build your life on. You yes, see, you know, yes. You see. Do you think you've you've achieved uh, that ideal scenario with the life that you've lived? Uh, this still loops here and there, but yeah, it's, yeah, fairly, it's fairly yeah. decent. Fairly yeah, decent, yeah. 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 Because it's interesting. It's a thought that crosses my mind a lot lately. Yeah, because, <laughs> it, it, again, when you are a living being, you've got to get to a point where you have that special mm. journey that you travel with your maker like that. Yeah, yeah. Family and all hang on you, but yes. even them, your family, yeah. individually, they should also have a journey with God. Their own but journeys. How wonderful if all your journeys yeah. are linked to this one family. Yes, they are linked together. You, you yeah. understand what I mean? Yeah. Your son working using the same family. That's it, yeah. Your wife living yes, yes. her own life, but using the same, the same source. Family. Yeah. You, you understand yeah. what I mean? Yeah. And then all of you reporting as individuals That's it. to this one thing. You see? I think it's fantastic. Has, has, has uh, marriage made you a, a better man? I wouldn't, well, look, I think discovering who I am yeah. has made me a better person. Not marriage as such, because marriage is not a bed of roses, eh? However, uh, however, it's a... However perfect it is. Some people say it's a, it's a, it's a mirror mm. where you get to see yourself. That's right. Yeah, yeah, where you get to always say, hey... I didn't know what saw. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, because a marriage, it because it's so close and you live with it every day. Yeah, yeah. It tends to show show your even your bad side <laughs> and it, your yeah. good side. Yeah, you become yes. very vulnerable. Exactly. Yeah. But, uh, at the same time, you can't write it off. No, no. Yeah. yeah. You can't write it off. Yeah. It's what you could call a necessary problem. <laughs> for lack of a better way I like that <laughs> it's a necessary problem I like that I, I think I'll go with that yeah. Mary, yeah. what is marriage it's so, a necessary problem yeah don't shy away from it eh? <laughs> yeah. you need to go through that yeah it's just, I would recommend it to anyone really yeah, mm, yeah. yeah. Do, do you have kids yeah I do have kids how many kids do they, did anyone inherit your voice uh, yeah I think my boys actually have my voice Jar. Mm. Your boys have your voice? Yeah, have not not, boys, yeah. not a watered down Oros by Taylor Manzi type <laughs> version. <laughs> no. They're real by Yeah, no. And if wow. they if they look after themselves. How I old are they now? How old are your kids now? My boys, let's see. My oldest boy is about twenty seven, I think. Yes, yeah, yes. Cool. And the other one is I can get no more Twenty four. Yeah. Yeah. With that voice. Yeah. But is any one of them interested in using the voice? Uh, one is interested in singing, actually. Yes, yeah. yes. Okay. Yes, you know, okay. this usual music yes, of the yeah, now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. But nothing radio. Nah, no one's That's amazing. Yeah. You walk around with a voice like that, you're like, Moshe, ah, <laughs> I, would, I would take all, half of it. It will be enough. You know? We, we like it now that we're not, we're not in the era where mm. to do radio, the voice is oh. the first thing they take. Yeah. You know, because that was the, when you were getting in, yeah. that was the first thing they wanted. The thing. You know, they needed a big voice yeah, and all yeah, of that. Yeah, yeah. We live in a time when uh, at least you can get away with having a half-cooked voice. Yeah, yeah, you know, like yeah. some of us. Yeah. I was there, you know, you can get away with half of it. Yeah, now yeah. it's more about content. Content, personality, personality, and all of that, yeah. And uh, sharpness, a lot of... Absolutely, uh, yeah. 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 Do you still enjoy your radio? Yeah, I still do very much. It's yeah. still, it still matters to you. It but what, what, what occupies your time now? Yeah, I spend a lot of time actually working on things like, uh, you know, like uh, societal things. Like, yeah, um, yeah. I help people with uh, NPOs, okay, you know, okay, non-profit okay. organizations, like women, yeah. disabled, and whatever. Okay, and I, I get I get into business with, with young people. Yes, and, uh, yes, yeah. Just showing them the way, the not way. taking the forefront. No, 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 you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Say, let me help you out. Yeah, yeah. I, I mentor them. So, yes. yeah. do you still involved mm -hmm. in a lot of mm -hmm. things, Ekas? Because sometimes yeah. we tend to 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 not to plow back. That's what I do, Ekas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. Working with young so people. Dube is still still dear to you. Yeah. Yeah. All, and all the surrounding townships, uh, yes. Meadowlands, okay. uh, yes. the Meadowlands, yes. uh, yes. yeah. yeah. 
Oh. Wow. Mm. I think uh, your, yours, uh, today's uh, show, this one we're doing here, yeah. to me is one that I've looked forward to for a long time. Oh, wow. I must admit. Uh, Great. And uh, I, know, I love the way you did it because, you, you know, I've been in, interviewed about this lots of times. You, you you let it take its own natural course. That's what it should be. <laughs> I, can't, so, I can't dictate yeah. it because I don't it, know what's going to happen. It's not about pre- Pre-arranged, pre no, questions. Because no. I don't know what's yeah. going to happen. You know <laughs> what I mean? Yeah. I, I let it I let it be. Yeah. And I've learned this uh, uh, through talking to some of the previous guys yeah. that, uh. you know, you cannot over plan for these things. Yeah. 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 Because t your, your life story uh, is, is your life story. Only you can tell it best. Yeah. Uh, and something that I've also learned also is uh, some people's journey towards radio is short. Yeah. And some people's journey towards radio is extremely long. That's it. So you don't know what shape. I had Bendigo over here. Yeah. His journey towards radio is long and hard and tricky and with challenges. And yours, you didn't even care. <laughs> Do you yeah. see what I mean? Yeah, but somehow radio cared for me. That's yeah? it, yes. And everything else that I did, you know, the very things that I did embraced me. Has radio yeah. ever frustrated you? Where he's like, yes, Lento. But it's it's my cast, it's my gift. <laughs> you know. Has it ever gotten to a point where he said, hey, yeah, I'm not sure anymore? Fortunately, it hasn't come to that. It hasn't, no. eh? It you hasn't know, exhausted you to a point where, yeah, it's like, I need a break. <laughs> no, no, no. It Nothing come yet, to that. Yeah. yeah. I always, yeah, because radio can be frustrating, especially it is, if you, yeah. you know. If you, you you can't find yourself and True. you can't really get to understand uh, yeah. what is it that I need here? Yeah, I see, see. But then it's seasonal. That kind of feeling is seasonal. Yeah. There comes a time when you feel, I, I, I'm, good now. Now. Yeah. Yeah, I'm good yeah. now. Yeah, I'm good. Yeah, yeah. I'm good to go now. Okay, yeah. okay. So, so it's it's natural to mm, feel mm, overburdened yeah. by it sometimes. That's right. I must yeah. admit, I mm. go through moments like that, not yeah. very often, yeah. where. I didn't enjoy the show today. Yeah, I feel like... Man. All right, right. Let's go like try I was, again. I was preoccupied. Exactly. Yeah, yes, see, yes. Yeah. Let's go try again. Yeah, yeah. I didn't enjoy it again yeah, today. Yeah. Now you start getting worried now. Yeah. You know, And I've gone through a moments like that in the mm. past six months or so well, yeah. where I would walk in, do the show, yeah. completely hate it. You know, yeah. And because, then and then because uh, we live on Twitter now, yeah. people enjoyed it. It's like, yeah. that doesn't make sense. <laughs> What's wrong with these people? Yes. <laughs> I'm frustrated. I sound unhappy. I didn't like the show. And they say, hey, I love it. I that love it. That was great, time. man. The first 30 minutes, yeah, Chief. Yeah. You should do that every day. It's like, I didn't like any yeah. of it. So it happens, I yeah, guess. Yeah, it does. It does. D do you still get a lot of people stopping you on the side of the road and say, hey, bro, treasure. Yeah. Hey. Yeah, because of this television thing. Yeah. See, yeah I, I do get a lot of people. In fact, there's nowhere where I come around and someone doesn't even. Because now, know. now yeah. you do these Zanzi shows. That's it, yeah. What is it? Abu Sbai or Martin? The Queen. Yeah, the Queen. Yeah, yes. the queen I think you've been there. on the Queen recently. Yeah. Yes. Are you still on the Queen? <laughs> no, I'm not there now. Yes. Yeah. What role were you playing? I was playing actually the the the, the Godfather. The, okay. The, yeah, the, the guy the, who's the, running this whole operation. Whoa. Yeah. The main guy in the family. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> But then the way, because I think because of, uh, you see the title is, is the queen. The queen, yeah. So you can't so make the godfather a, a, prominent a prominent figure. figure. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. I was there just to establish it and, and then, then allow, then the allow her to be. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, man. Amazing. You still have these TV roles <laughs> <laughs> at your 66-year-old age. Yeah, because in life, there are old people anyway. So. You know what? I wish you, I wish you uh, in the, the next 40 remaining years of yeah. your life, yeah. I wish you uh, a big, big, big international role. It'll happen. I wish you a big international role. One of those, long. one of those, wow, man. Yeah. I'm doing that? Yeah. I have Al Pacino here. Yeah. It's just an, an epic role, sort of. Right? Yeah. Be beca because, because Hollywood has, has embraced and is completely embracing Africa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and, and South African actors, for some reason, seem to get roles in all of the stuff that happens in, in Hollywood. Yeah, it's because we have something in us that we're not aware of. Yeah, so. yeah. But it's there, and, and it's an attribute. That's why. Look at how these uh, these children are going on, eh? Jeez. This in love with choir and stuff. You know like what I mean? Oh. And, and we have this knack of... Coming in, being the small country when yes. you compared to other countries. To other countries, yeah. yeah. And uh, we have this knack of coming in 
and just taking the best. Out That's of it. That is so Be true. The Oscars or whatever, yes, you know, yes, yes. we're just counting we've done, we've, many. Mm. We've done well for mm. a country our size yeah. to have produced so many international stars. Yeah. Uh, the, the, the movie uh, with, what is it, uh, uh, with Wakanda and all yeah, of that, yeah, yeah. It, it, South Africa is a dominant figure even spiritually in That's the it. movie because of the language that is spoken That's in that mo- Black yeah. Panther. The longest language that's spoken in that, la- in that movie is a mm. South African language. Uh, the king's son is South African. Yeah. The music that's played in the background yeah. is South African, yeah. Kwaito and, yeah. and, and, yeah. and House. Yeah. And you look at it like, wow, man, South Africa played a big role in one of the biggest movies ever made in look the world. Yeah. And uh, you're right, we probably don't, don't, I'm not the first to recognize it. That's it. We're not the first to say, yes, Mars blind. We are blessed. We are. Yeah. And I think we should remember it often. And embrace that. True. Mm. We have your Chalice. We have your Trevor Norris. Look at that. We have this, uh, this, uh, there's so many, there's so many. There's a guy, the movie that was made in South Africa, District 9. Yeah, yeah. It, it was made in South Africa mm. in Alex. Yeah. And it features a, uh, a big South African actor. Then he, he wasn't big. Yeah. And now he's gone on to do probably 50 more movies after that. Look at that. I wish you a big movie role. Thanks, my brother. What happens to you on radio doesn't matter as much for me, because <laughs> I think you'll all, your voice will always find its way on radio. Definitely. But I, but I, I think I wish you a big, big international role. Look, Gorgis Kumba. Yeah. Uh, what is he? He's the king. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll play that one one day. Don't worry. <laughs> wow! Thank you so much, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. The great, legendary, that the treasure Chavala. Thank you very much. Wow. What a star. <laughs> I've made it. <laughs> Thank you very much. Eh? Thanks, David. <laughs> <A show. laughs>